out here a while. Time to reapply! I've been thinking. Should we be worried about Sunset Shimmer? Yeah, worried she comes back. I think it's a shame the way she's treating you, pretending to be your friends. She's obviously up to something. Sunset thinks the whole school exists just to serve her. Water, please. You know, seeing as how the yearbook president seems to be having a little identity crisis, I believe that means the vice president takes over and why... That's you, Rarity. If this is your way of asking to be made the greatest and most powerful, the answer is no. And didn't we have this conversation yesterday? I can't quite remember. Uh. Hmm. Maybe we did, maybe we didn't. Memory is such a fickle thing. You never know when you'll forget something important, like how great and powerful I am. Which is why I need to be in the yearbook. <sighs> I'll think about it. That's all I ask. I should be getting back to my world. Maybe I can convince my friends I'm telling the truth now that I know what we're looking for. The memory stone. I'll stay here and search the restricted section, top to bottom, until I find a way to get your friends' memories back. If that's even possible. Oh, it's possible. Even if I have to reorganize the whole library by subject. Or maybe chronologically, I'll figure it out. Thank you. Both of you. This is quite a contrast from the last time we parted ways. But you are not that way anymore. With every choice you make, you prove yourself to possess a kind heart. I guess I had a good teacher. You were a good student. <laughs> <laughs> are you saying I wasn't a good teacher? Oh, no, I wasn't. I'm, she what didn't I meant, say that. She I... didn't say that. I... <laughs> Princess Celestia has a sense of humor. Looks like I'm not the only one who's changed. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not holding back this time! That's what I'm afraid of. Bring it on, Rainbow Dash! You and Verity just bought your team a one-way ticket on the express train to your going down! Oh, nice game face, Pinkie Pie. Thanks! I've been practicing all day. Isn't that right, little baby camera? You're in my house! <laughs> Somebody's jealous. Please, call me when the flying can opener learns how to fetch. You're the worst. Great news, guys. I figured it out. Someone's erased your memory with equestrian magic. You don't remember, but we're still friends. This is the memory stone. Do you recognize it? Uh, right, guess not. But look. See, this is proof. We are friends. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Please. This is the same girl who made flawless fake photos of your friend trashing the gym. Yeah, wait a minute. Is this supposed to be me making such a ridiculous face? <laughs> I'd never make a face like that. Preposterous! Fake, I say! <laughs> My work here is done. Trixie, And don't forget, Rarity, you promised to put me in the yearbook. Wait, you did what? Oh. <gasps> it was an accident. I can help fix it. I think you've helped enough. So, 
here we are. Here we do are. You really want to do this here, in the hallway, in front of everyone? Up to you. Behold! Canterlot High School's greatest and powerfulest student! If a seven-scale mock-up doesn't convince you, I don't know what will. Where's the memory stone? You turn my friends against me just because I wouldn't put you in the yearbook as the greatest and powerfulest? The powerfulest isn't even a word! What are you talking about? It's not a word! No, what memory stone? The one you use to erase everyone's memory, you manipulative blowhard! A stone that could make everyone forget all the bad tricks I've done? <gasps> Which is no tricks. Your puny rock pales in comparison to the great and powerful Trixie. I don't believe it. You have no idea what I'm talking about. I don't. Sorry. <sighs> Did somebody really erase everyone's memories of you? Mm-hmm. And even though we all know you're the biggest meanie, you're saying you're not mean anymore? It's complicated. So you have this idea of who you're supposed to be, but no one at school sees you that way. Is that it? Trust me, I get it. <laughs> I can't believe the only person who believes me is the one I called a manipulative blowhard. Sorry. I took it as a compliment. Let me help you find the stone. What's in it for you? No way, absolutely not. Well, if you'd rather go on being the biggest meanie, that's fine by me. I've looked everywhere. Why can't I find the missing pages? I've always been good to you, library! This is it. The last piece was in a secret compartment. Clover the Clever buried the stone. This rock formation must be somewhere in the other world. But it doesn't say how to get your memories back. <gasps> Perhaps if I had destroyed the stone right away, some of my memories could have returned. But when the sun sets by the third day after a memory has been taken, it is erased forever. You must warn Sunset Shimmer at once. So, where should we start, partner? How about with what I call you? I'm thinking the great and powerful Trixies! A pretty decent assistant detective helper person.